Compatible with Beneath the Lily Ballast 3rd Edition, The War of Three Kings, the new With Talon and Claw supplement adds additional levels of detail to games set during the Great Northern War, 1700-1721, and the Eastern Wars, 1670-1723. A 183-page hardback book, this is a blend of historical facts, gaming rules and uniform resources that looks great. The book begins with a very useful period primer, which pretty much outlines the many and varied wars which may be gained during this period. In a sense, this is really a potted history of many forgotten or poorly remembered conflicts that took place. A nice touch is the use of a campaign map, which puts into further context where and when things happened. The book then moves forwards in an attempt to formulate a point system takes the reader through the main rules as they pertain to the various styles of leadership, the various troop types peculiar to the various wars and how they were organised, the particular qualities associated with different troop types, national characteristics, how to base your models and tabletop unit sizes. Another interesting feature of the book is the fact it adds some unique rules or extras to the turn sequence outlined in the core rulebook, such as the Swedish double order option plus pages which highlight particular styles of combat and battlefield features. There are some very well done examples of movement conveyed using photographic photographs of the same, plus charts and tables which summarise what has been outlined over previous pages. An overview of the effects of local weather and terrain adds more to the rules by adding such local phenomena as frozen lakes, extremes of temperature and much more. The book continues in a similar style, providing additional rules for charging, shooting, artillery, close combat and much more. The effects of morale for different nationalities and troop types is examined, a game with suitable charts and rules. After all those rules and national characteristics, players will have probably decided which army they'd like to run. That's where the next sections come in, bringing some comprehensive information on various armies, plus some excellent uniform plates with regimental and flag guides. Lastly, the book provides a sample scenario, more a battle report, an account of the Battle of Valeshka in 1709, which covers the main force involved, table setups, regimental uniforms and flags, and some exceptional photographs of figures on the tabletop, plus a turn-by-turn -turn account of a refight. This supplement has many useful facets that really aim to support the gamer and provides a great starting point for those looking to recreate particular forces or wars. The real joy of this supplement is the fact it packs in so much into a few pages and does it with some style thanks to the use of photographs of war games figures in action and some excellent and helpful uniform plates. This video has been produced by WI Prime. WI Prime is Wargames Illustrated Magazine's online members club. As a WI Prime member, you get access to all Wargames Illustrated videos before anyone else. We'll keep you posted on what's new via the Primetime News Bulletin delivered to your inbox every Friday. If you are not a WI Prime member, you're missing out on loads of benefits, including access to the Wargames Illustrated Vault, freebies, discount vouchers, PDFs of the latest magazine, and more. Find out more about WI Prime by following the link.